We are sorry to interrupt your viewing schedule, but we have sightings of a dangerous and abnormal weather occurrence once again here in downtown Lawrence, Kansas. I am David Johanning, your Channel 69 news anchor, along with anchor woman Debbie Johanning. We will be updating you on all the weather occurrences as they happen. Well, Dave, we're receiving reports of high winds and scattered snowflakes and napkins flying through the air. All of these are headed this way, Dave. Let's look at our area map. This has all the characteristics of a real-life hurricane heading straight to downtown Lawrence. Let's check with our local expert on everything, Tom Conroy, owner of Casper's Bar and Grill in Lawrence. Tom, have you ever heard of anything like this before? You know, this is remarkably similar to the big blow of the coast of England that defeated the Spanish Armada in 1588. And how, do you ask, could England win? Well, it was because Queen Elizabeth was astute enough to delay war by tantalizing, yet keeping at bay, royal suitors from both Spain and France who thought it would be easier to marry her rather than take over England through war. She was smart enough to rebuild her treasury that was bankrupted by her sister Mary, hence staying a virgin, hence the Virgin Queen, hence the state of Virginia, named after her by Sir Walter Raleigh, and then it could have been Elizabeth Land, Liz Land, or better still, Les Land. <laughs> her brilliance also manifested itself in retaining her sister's advisor, William Cecil, who was politically shrewd and kept the Catholics and the Protestants happy. Although they both vied for ultimate power in both England and Scotland, which was to lead to the rise of the Puritans and their rule under the Roundheads, under the leadership of Oliver Cromwell, hence the murder of Charles I. Thanks, Tom. Thanks, Tom. And now, for a direct live report from the United States Hurricane Center at NASA. Let's go to correspondent Pat Conroy. The sky is blue and the temperature is beautiful at 85. The nightclubs are hopping and the sugary sand beach is just the most inviting place I've ever been. I got a little bit too much sun yesterday, so I put on some extra sunscreen and I'm heading to the bar in a few seconds for another tropical rum punch. Uh, excuse me, Patrick. Yes? Aren't you supposed to be at NASA, the National Aeronautics and Space Administration? Yes, I am. And Patrick, aren't you in fact in NASA? Am I going to have to pay for this? Correspondent Pat Conroy paying for his own vacation in Nassau. And now for a word from our sponsor. Aren't you tired of being the last one on the block to hear about a really great deal? I mean really. When is the last time your real estate agent called and told you of a great piece of property? Hi, I'm Marilyn Bittenbender and I'm here to tell you about some fabulous oceanfront property that has just opened up. I mean this second this piece has become available. Only for a select few. Come on down to 8th and New Hampshire and check it out. This once in a lifetime opportunity. The price is sensational. And you better call now before it goes. Call me at 1-800-GREAT-DEAL. Give me a call. Bye y'all. Now let's go to our man on the street, Pat Musrush. The humanity of it all. I'm headed out here at Don Steakhouse and the winds are going crazy out here. There's something big going on this year. I think it's going to be bigger than last year. I'm out here with Gary Barge. He's on his world famous lookout bowl. What do you see up there, Gary? Well, Pat, it looks like it's going to get kind of messy around here. Yep, it's definitely a hurricane. Better slip in here and get some ribs before it's too late. Wait a minute, who's that down there? Insurance. Get your hurricane insurance right here, right now. You know, normally hurricane insurance would cost you at least $30 a month, but we have a special offer today. You can have one month for $19.95, and if you'll call in the next 15 minutes, we'll give you two months for $19.95 and throw in a set of Ginsu knives. Get your hurricane insurance. Get it today. Well, yeah, well, that's all. That guy will do anything to wear a yellow suit. Back to you, Dave. Now it's time to check in with City Hall to see how officials are preparing for this storm. Thanks, Debbie. Hello, Lawrence citizens. Our emergency response teams are activated. Our citizens' hotlines are on. Our crews are ready. Marty. We are prepared to protect our citizens. Marty. Marty, are you trying to do a woman's job? No, I am not trying to do a woman's job. When I was mayor, 
We didn't have any hurricane problems in this town. Yes, but Marty, when you were mayor, we had problems with roundabouts. I've told you once, I'm going to tell you again. Get ready, Lawrence. This is really going to be a bigger one. His name was Jimmy, he was a sailor, a captain of a fancy ship, hard working, he never quit, he would set sail for many miles. Then one night he caught a storm, that his ship got broken, torn, the sea was angry and hot, waves stormed and tossed, wrecked onto the sandbar, you think Jimmy was lost at the sandbar. sightings of a dangerous and abnormal weather occurrence once again here in downtown Lawrence, Kansas. I am Debbie Johanny. <laughs> Aren't you supposed to be in NASA, the National Aer Aer Aeronautics? It's as big as a whale, and we're heading on down to the sandbar. I got me a Chrysler. It seats about 20. Excuse me, Patrick. Aren't you supposed to be at NASA, the National Aer Sign says, stay away. 
always on a chair. Patrick, aren't you supposed to be at NASA, the National Area? Pat Conroy paying for his own vacation in NASA. Right there.